So serving with this racket was um, very forgiving. It's a lot lighter weight than the other two rackets in this series. It's got a much bigger head size and a much more open string pattern, so you could get a lot more spin. You can't get the kind of penetration and, uh, and pace of board you can off the other two, but that is down to the weight and the fact it's kind of a different racket. Um, although it is in the same series, I'm not sure it's plays exactly the same because it is lighter. Um, if you're looking for a racket to start off in the Signature Series and then build your way up to the 95 or maybe even the 90, this is a good place to start. For me, I'd add a lot more weight to it, uh, try and get a more of a penetrating shot as you do from something like the 95. The spin you could get off this frame with ground strokes was excellent, especially in compar comparison to the other two, and that is, again, due to the forgiveness which we've been talking about. Also, um, the volleys, much more forgiving, much more manoeuvrable feel to this racket uh, due to the lightweight and obviously, again, the bigger sweet spot. You can literally just put your racket there, let the racket do the work. Whereas with something like the 90 or the 95, you have to be a lot more precise and actually really punch through it. But I mean, if, if you're looking for a 280 gram racket and you want some great feel and some great touch from it, this is a good place to start looking. Yeah, and, and, he's, and he's, as John's saying, I really feel that these rackets are really designed to look as if you're playing with the 90 which is what I'm holding and now it's a very desirable racket to play with but as we've talked about on our reviews of it if you can play with it well you are you're not going to find anything better but if you if you're going to struggle or your technique isn't up to it or maybe maybe your fitness isn't up to it um, it really is a tough racket to play with it which is where this comes in as either a, a transitional racket or a racket that can make you feel as though you're playing with this one it does have good feel it does have good spin and as John says um, this the power is is low but it's the same with all of all of this range of rackets. I personally think that Wilson have done a decent job with this, um, of creating a, a racket as a mimic of another, and I think that they've done a great job of doing it, and it's a, it's a racket that has been needed in the Wilson range, and I think they've done a good job of it. So if you want to check it out, check us out on stringswell.com.